What is up, 1320 fans? We are here in Tulsa, Oklahoma for a cash day style race, and the pot is $25,000. And that's probably about the most normal thing you're going to hear from us uh, today and for the rest of the weekend. We're going to film some stuff, and I'll explain some stuff later, but this is a little different than what we're used to, so let's go get into it. Jeez. There's a lot of people out here. I've been to a lot of cash days. I don't think I've seen like tents and this many people in I one spot this, before. I don't think I've seen this many children at one before either. This is pretty freaking cool. What do you think? It looks like there's, it looks kind of cool to see the cars, you know, how they look like the cars were filming in real life. It's not just all one style. Got we got some C C C7s. We got a third gen over there. What do we got? Ooh, we got a couple six gen Camaros. Corvettes. This is a stout looking cash day, this boys. This is really cool. Here. Racing, what do you think? Are you serious? Yeah, me, Sean. You're joking. You're joking. Dude, really? I saw Kyle. These are uh, some street friends from New Mexico. You do real car stuff, and this is mini car stuff. You're going to have to give us the rundown on how this stuff... This is our first one. Yeah. For those that are just catching on, this is an RC race. I think there's 512 cars going to be on the property this weekend. 512 car cash days on the street. They're all electric, right? All electric. They do like 80 miles an hour, and and it's like, one. was it, 132 feet? 132 feet instead of 1320, it's 132. Yeah, we're going to walk around and take a look at them. By the way, yeah, it's $25,000 pot. All right, we're new to this. We're gonna keep walking around, looking at yeah, stuff. Okay, real quick. Like he doesn't run them yet. I don't. Are think. these? Are these? Uh, they're belted. So are they're they like belted? Radial. They're belted. Yep. Okay, so these they're not. The they're not gonna... These are the Voodoo. So they're the new belted tire that came on the market about two months ago, and they're just wrecking everything. Though. I was gonna add because really I've seen tire. them. I've seen these things do like burnouts yeah. before, and the tires really yeah, they grow. Balloon. That's yeah. what we were doing last year, but these came out about four or five months ago, and they're just whooping everybody. Really? Yeah. Well, the reactions work pretty good. You too. can feel. You can feel that. There's a belt inside of them. You feel a little stick on that. You're a little. Oh yeah, we didn't clean them yet. We we at the test spot earlier. Yeah. We're we'll cleaning back clean off them right and sticking them and all that stuff. So here we that's go. The stuff we, that stuff we were selling for real cars. It's kind of like pimp juice, this and that. We can sell a bunch of a little bit here and there. We kind of played with it, but we just crossed it over to little cars and it works really good too. <laughs> it's all the same shit. What's up, I'm Fred. This is Fred. Fred. This is Fred. I'm Fred. Yeah. I'm Scott. Scott and Jared Mills. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. One of the race master champions. You're, you're running the deal here? All right, give us a rundown real quick. What would what, what, what we just walk into? We've never been to one of these. You walked into some craziness. So uh, unloading, getting the pit set up is, is a madhouse. And then once we get registration, the registration line is already packing up. Once we get through that, it kind of settles down. People get their cars. We're going to do some runs tonight. So you'll see some fast passes. People we're trying to get accustomed to the surface. Okay. Once they get dialed in, um, they're comfortable with the cars. You'll see people doing multiple passes. Some people will want it done. Um, then we'll a bunch of conversations, you know, BS talking in a pit. And then tomorrow it's going to be game on. The game faces will come on. Right now it's kind of relaxed. People are meeting each other for the first time. Uh, Facebook guys, social media guys meeting face to face for the first time. Sure. So, but I mean, yeah, you walked into what's going to turn out the biggest RC drag race in the country to date. So really, yeah. are they motor limited, tire limited, are voltage limited? Uh, what, what are those limits? So no motor limit. Got that one. Um, they are they are limited on a 2S battery, and eight, which which means what? 8.44 volts. Okay. So they can charge up to that, and we'll have a tech spot, and we'll have a guy put a multimeter on their stuff to make sure they're not open. Right before they go. Yep. Right okay. before they hit. So is there is there a weight? Is the to make a weight? There's or a weight. It's four and a half pounds or 2,060 grams. Okay. There's a scale right there. See all those little... Yeah, that's that's the scale oh, of the car. Wait, it's actually got corner scales? Yeah. Yes. That's no like way. This is so much like, like real, real drag, drag racing. This is legit drag race. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and we were just talking about this earlier. Witty, Witty brought that up. Uh, that... The, for how much, I'm sure these cars aren't cheap, but compared to how much the cars cost to how much you can win, it's a crazy ratio because you go to a normal race, if they're saying 20000 to win, the car probably costs, the car that won probably costs $100,000. So it's a, it, this is a crazy ratio. I don't, this is going to get big if this is the payout. So cars here, cars here can cost anywhere on the low end from 
It's really not that bad. Well, we're going to keep walking around the pits, take a listen to stuff. Thank you so much for stopping. Yeah. We'll ask you some more questions, Mr. Sure, before this is done. All right, shout out to Jared, the race master. He just gave us the full rundown on how this stuff goes. We're going to keep walking around the pits. There's supposed to be 500 plus cars on the property. And over 20, like 20,000, you think he said? $20,000? Insane. What you looking at, Matt? What you got? Yeah, I like this third gen, man. Yeah. I like that C10 a lot, too. Third that is real cool. Good. It's got a hole in the vent. In the lead. Yeah, some vents? So, this is super realistic. Did, did oh, yeah. you do you just buy it like this? Like, no, no. Actually, he's he paints all my bodies for me because I, I, I just can't do it. And uh, we're going so fast, these tires will actually balloon. So, if you look, the tires balloon oh so much, it's melting the plastic. Get out! So even though even though these are belted tires, these are belted. They're they're still ballooning at speed. We got guys running. You're gonna see some fast passes. That's super cool. So this is just like a kit you buy and you have to paint. Yep. So, so this is the TLR 22 5.0 on a uh, undercover chassis. It's uh, the first one ever made. I had Greg do it for me. And then you get the body and clear. So you can see some guys running out here with clear bodies that they bought. And uh, you gotta paint it yourself and you paint it however you want. This is freaking crazy. So like you get the kit, you add paint, you add batteries and Exactly. You yeah. just go, you gotta pick out the tires. You pick out tires you want, you pick out electronics, it's all it's, have you it's, seen them run yet? I have not seen these you run yet. You have to see these run. Well, that's what I'm here for. I'm, oh I'm hoping to see some fast little RC cars. You guys will be like, what the heck? Awesome. Right now, I just feel like I stepped into a whole other world that I didn't even know existed. But thanks for taking time to tell me about this car, man. I love, I love the uh, die rock. That's cool. I like the C10 over here. It's got the drag wing on it too. He's got bead locks and stuff. Carbon fiber bead locks. You can't get those for. What? Look at the billet parts. Can you imagine we're out late, we're on a computer, we're looking for race car parts, but it's for these. To show you guys the scale of what we're dealing with here, this is a parking lot in a industrial area. This is the warehouse. It starts down there, the pits start down there, and they go all the way over there, and this right here is where they're racing. 132 feet right here somewhere, and then shut down is just go that way. So that's what we're looking at right now. They said 250 some odd people, and you can double enter, and almost everybody I think does. So we're looking at 500 plus cars. Twenty to twenty-five thousand dollars is the is the final pot, and the winner gets eighty percent of that with an RC car. And max, max that they're probably spending is like three grand on these things. Insane. This Nova's seen some stuff right here. He looks a little fast beat up. Pass brought us what seen. Yeah. And we got the third gen. If Cletus had an RC drag car, this would be it right here. It's got tire warmers. Like these are plugged in, warming up the tires. These lanes are huge. This this is literally like 20 foot lane, 20 foot lane. So last night, I got to go to my buddy's house and he had two little drag cars, probably like a quarter of how fast these are gonna be. But these things turn really quick and it's unexpected. So oh yeah. I, I appreciate them having these here because 80 miles an hour, that hits 80, 80 miles an hour in 1.8 seconds. So it starts there at the tree, goes to there, 132 feet. That's what we're dealing with. And the light is almost like full-size looking light because it's full-size people that are controlling these things. <laughs> Time on that? That thing looked fast as hell. TT, T24 mile an hour, 59 mile an hour. Jeez! That bit's quick one just did a frickin', that was on a pass right there. He did wreck at the end, looked like the wing took some damage when he was slowing down, but these things are frickin' quick, man. Right, look at the line. This is testing, guys. All of these guys are holding their cars. The line goes all the way back there. All the way back, guys. I got right lane again. It should be fair. 
Yeah, oh, dude, look at that C7 in the left, bro. Look at the paint job on that thing. You serious? Well, we got right lane. Okay, silver. All right, I see you. Yeah, buddy, I've been three for three. That's what I'm talking about. I should start betting money. Who wants who wants a dollar? That's a dollar. I like I'm three for three right now. Yo, these guys got underglow on theirs. Check this out. All right, I like I like blue, so I'm going left lane. They're both blue. Some of these guys' reaction time is great. It's a way bigger deal. Right? Oh no, that was Ooh. Oh! Oh! <laughs> that was a good race, though. That was. Good. I'll oh. take that dollar any time, though. These guys got whole trailers set up just for this. Yeah. Work by engine. How's it going, fellas? Cool. Hey, there are you. You mind if we take a look at your trailer? Hey, come on. This is so cool. Now there's guys with tents and these guys are big dogging it over here with trailers and workbenches and stuff. Yeah. Look at all the good. bodies they got. I think they could see what I was getting into. I did not think I'd see all the Is this whole setup just for RC racing? Yeah. I, I do nothing but RC and uh, race dirt oval, off road, and drag race. So. That's all you do? Yep. That's so freaking awesome. The reward's the same when you win. I know! More. And yeah. you spend so much less on one of these than you do a big car. I've never seen a no prep race bring 25 grand. Do you, is it, does the same, do all the bodies fit on different chassis? So, you just so the body is just universal. Uh, you just put, put your, your, in. your body posts in it, and then when it's clear, you mount it up, and you know, get your whole set. Because there's tons of different chassis manufacturers out there. Gotcha. Yep. Well, we'll see you boys out there. Yep. Good luck. Yep. So I'm going to say these guys are the guys that have, like, the at our races, like the double stacker, yeah. four car with the lift and stuff. That's what that's what these guys are with so with the trailer. So Bisquick should left lane win this. Bisquick Cadillac. I got I got left lane on this. Bisquick Cadillac. Bisquick. 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 That Bisquick. <laughs> he, he, yeah. Look at the tree. Look at the tree. Look at the tree. Who won? He treed the shit out of him. Left, left lane took that. He trees the shit out of people. So what are you guys doing with the cars between rounds? Uh, cleaning tires, charging batteries, put tire warmers on them, maybe go through the tune-up, just anything in the speed control. Basically normal stuff you would do at a real race. Yeah. Like a real big, yeah. like big car. all the same stuff you'd really do. Yeah. I mean, like, if there's some guys that are cataloging, they'll plug it into the phone or into the laptop and go back through, look at the data, <laughs> see what they're changing, see where they need to make changes. All the same thing you do at a real car. It's crazy. All right, guys, it's almost 11 o'clock. They're doing testing till 1 a.m. We're not going to stay that late, but all these guys are going to stay here, do testing till 1 a.m. And then the track goes hot at 9 a.m. tomorrow, and they think it's going to go pretty late, like 11 or 12 o'clock tomorrow night. So 15 hours of racing tomorrow is what we're expecting. We're going to go get some sleep, and we'll meet you guys back here in the morning for some legit racing. Some serious legit. Stuff. Somebody's walking home with like 20 grand tomorrow. I think somebody's about to buy a lot of RC cars. Yeah, 20 grand tomorrow. All right, guys, we are back. It's 8.45 in the morning. Pits are starting to fill up today. Oh, yes. We're expecting 500 entries of cars today, 20,000 like we said yesterday. They're going to do a little bit more testing this morning. They're going to jump into eliminations, and apparently eliminations are going to take 12-plus hours. As ridiculous as that sounds, that's what's happening. I was, I was, what, what surprised you yesterday? Uh, just the caliber of, like, stuff they have that goes into this. Like, I didn't, I didn't know that they tuned their cars. I thought the tuning was ridiculous. I did, too. I, I had no too. idea that they, that they could tune their shit like that. The race is, like, two seconds, but they tuned to, like, 0 .02 seconds, 0 .5 seconds into the run. Crazy. So, we're going to dive into it and get, get, walk around pits more and find out some more stuff. We're all learning this stuff today and yesterday. So, let's go. Hey, represent... We got the 1320C10 in the left lane. Do us proud. Ooh! Oh! Ooh! And landed it! And landed it! Nice one! Testing is done. We're about to get jumping into eliminations, but before that, they're gonna do a special picture, which is everybody's gonna bring all of their cars, or at least their bodies, onto the track, lay them all out, all 500 of them. And they're gonna get a sweet, sweet picture. So this is gonna be pretty cool to see all of them all in one spot. If I'm just like this, those look like real cars. That's just that; those are real cars right there. And 
then you go like that and you see my feet. Yeah, exactly. That's so great. Look, watch, watch, watch. There's nobody in frame. All right, driver's meeting is done. There is 300 and some odd entries. Uh, a lot of these guys double enter, and you can do that because they don't want you to travel all this way. Just get knocked out first round. Like some of these guys came from New Jersey, California, and all that. So you can double enter, and there's two different sides of the bracket for that. So there's 300 and some odd entries. I don't know what the pot is. It's near $20,000 still, and uh, we're about to get going here with the first round. There should be, I don't know how, there's going to be a lot, a lot of, this is the racing itself, even if it was one minute per race, is going to take hours and hours and hours. So we're in for a long, we're in for a long day, but this should be pretty exciting. Like I said, at the end of the day, it's kind of crazy to think one of these guys that has a technically a toy is going to get $20,000 for it. So here we go. Is it time? It's time. It's time. Here we go. First pair of the first round. DE Racing Super Chip going down right now. First round, first pair coming at you. Check it out. Doing their burnout. That's the first pair. Concrete burnout only for him. He did it on the carpet. Left lane sounds strong. Dude, we got a C7 in the right lane. We got a Cadillac in the left lane. Which one you got? I got left lane just because that burnout sounded strong. I'm taking the vet. Well, the C7s are pretty quick. Oh, shit. The right lane got him. Got him. All right, so now we just got like 13 more hours of this. <laughs> yep. <laughs> yep. All right, the right lane, I'm pretty sure this one won the whole thing last year. With them. There's only like 40 or 50 guys here. Hey, sir, watch the light. Oh! Oh, shit. Oh, my God. Are you good? Yeah, I'm good. Okay. That's why we don't sit down, pal. That just smoked somebody. I know. Yeah. We got the mistress in the left lane over here. Ooh, mistress going on the second round. Hey, Mark over left lane, Josh. Really in the right. All that torque, man. Push the dang pavement back. This quick loss. Wonder Bread, left lane. Dang oh! That was a pass. 195. Woo! Left lane was 195. Woo! for the win. Congrats. Thank you. Moving on. All right. What kind of changes are you making from C. round one to round two? C. C. Uh -huh. Nothing. Nothing? Just charge her up and ready to go? I changed it a little bit between the first two races, but we've been going right now. Just so leave it be. Right? All right. I mean, that, that top, top crowd's pretty tight. A lot of two O's up there, so. What'd you do? What was your fast ET earlier? Is it a 195? Yeah, I think so. 190 something, I think. And then we changed it a little bit, slowed it down a little bit, but it's going to be on a tree, I think, this one. Now it's hard to get it tight. Pass round one, pass two, round two and three, so start tightening it up. Oh, yeah. Yep. A lot of two old guys. Good luck to you. Thank you. Yeah. Oh, 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 oh,
Wonder Bread for the win. Yeah. Wonder Bread for the win. What's up, dude? What's your name? Fred. Brett? Fred. F R E D. Fred. That's yeah. That's my name. It's real. How's it going, man? Nice to meet you, bro. Okay. Left lane. Oh, baby, no. Oh, oh. Right, right lane. Dang. Right. Oh, yeah. Ooh, the red third gen's coming up. Favorite car, right? Yeah, red third gen with the 1320 America sticker is coming up in the left lane. Left lane. Oh, Nick. I don't know what it is. Oh, oh. Oh. He's done. All right, we got Matt. We got John. Didn't think we'd see this matchup in the second round. Let's see what we got. Matt is one of our buddies from Albuquerque, and John we just met this weekend, but he's very experienced. Dang. Matt just destroyed him on that one. Yeah. Taking out some heavy hitters over here. Yeah, that, was nice. that dude's uh, that, that dude straight up does this for a living. I know. Like this, this is his job. So you're moving on to the third round. Yes, are you still in your second round, or you've already done, done that I'm one? Still on my second round. I got another hit. He okay. Has, well, he's moved on to third in one race. Oh, okay. And he has another. Race. Gotcha. Gotcha. He's gotcha. still on the same boat as him. Same. Gotcha. So gotcha. Both, both of our chips are still alive. Yes, sir. This is awesome. We have guys we can follow that we actually know. I did not think we'd have this. Help me, baby Jesus. <laughs> the ninjas are getting me. Good luck in the third round, guys. Thank you. Ooh. Look at him go. I think Chief is about to make a pass here. I think it's Chief. Oh wait, that's Chief. Carson, back it out. He's qualified, bud. Big two forty-two. Got Young Buck over here. Oh, gonna be close late. Oh, like oh. We got Matt in the right lane. Yes, sir. In the Mustang. Dang. I tell you what, these New Mexico boys are impressing me. They're doing pretty damn well. They're going rounds. We got Bisquick in the right lane. Bisquick, right lane. Bisquick, right lane. Oh! Right lane. Oh, oh dang! Oh, oh, nice. Waffles for everybody. This way. All right, we are in between the second and third rounds. I'm walking through the pitch right now. Some of the people have already left because they already got knocked out. A lot of people are still here. We're going to go get some updates from our New Mexico friends that are both still in right now and uh, talk to some other racers probably before the round gets going. How are we doing? You guys, you guys both so moving on to the third round? But are you both have two entries left? Both chips, yeah. Really? Ooh, you guys are making rounds right now. Yet. Everybody made it to the semis of our brackets without losing. So this is technically the quarterfinals overall? Well, there's ten brackets, I think. Oh. So we're at the top four of each bracket. Oh, so, okay. Yeah, they'll be ten, they'll be top ten if we win all of the next two races. So we'll be the top ten. Gotcha. So in the top. 40 right now, I think. If I, if my mouth's right. What changes do you guys make when it gets cooler like this out? I put a, I put a softer set of tires on mine. A set of reds. They go by colors, right? Gold, red, blue is the compounds. Okay. So I put a softer set on mine. He's not changing his. Anthony, 
put a softer set of tires on mine because it likes it. This is working. I got a sauce. We'll start backing the tubes down. Maybe I got a sauce in a minute. Do you think it'd be easier to blow the tires off right now because it's a little cooler? Oh, yeah. That last pass I had to drive it. It just spun about the track pretty hard. It's cooling down. So I'm changing my tune to kind of hopefully adjust for that. Hopefully it works. This is wild as hell because they're talking about race car stuff and I hear all this stuff. Racers say all the same words, but they're talking about these RC cars. It blows my mind. All right, we move on to third round here in a couple minutes. They just counted all the participants that are still in. We got 80 left, so there's 80 participants still left. It is 9.30 p.m. We're going to be here late, after midnight probably, to get this thing done. Only dirty California. That's true. <laughs> Solid. Oh, got him. What did you do, 199? Yeah. Look at you. Back in the moving ones on, again. Moving on, moving on. We got Matt in the right lane. <laughs> Look at Matt. Matt's running to mid-track. It's not going to take him long to get there. He's running to the finish line. Oh, he's all the way to the finish line now. <laughs> Easy yeah, money. Easy right money. Lane, man, with the win. What'd you do that? What'd you do? 207. Uh, not bad. Not bad. Not bad. Not bad. There it is. There it is. Moving on. What other race can you watch the burnouts from the starting line and run to the finish line and cover it with seconds to spare? None. Yeah. <laughs> I was like, look at him go. He's got. Oh, he's going all the way to the finish line. Dude, that's weird. I like got there and I was like, that was a little easier than I thought it was going to be. <laughs> Consistent one nines basically all day with the Wonder Bread car. And I haven't really heard of any other drivers doing that, and he's doing it very quietly. So hopefully he keeps going rounds and keeps doing those one nines with great reaction times. And uh, maybe, maybe make it to the finals. Maybe win. We'll see. Sean just did? No. 2 0? Probably. Alright, alright. Matt in the right. Right lane, Matt. It's on the next round. Up now, Frank and Dustin. 2 0 6, going rounds, baby. Going rounds. We got this quick in the house. Kept it off the wall. Let Did not cross the line in time. Moving on. So, yeah, we have 40 cars left. We do have four rounds of racing left. And right now they're doing like 30, 45 minutes between rounds. I think we can cut that down a little bit. Maybe get this done b between two and three instead of three and four. 
either way, somebody's going home with a bunch of money. It's going to be somebody in these final 40. So we're getting these races are getting tighter. Left lane. Left lane. Yeah. What do we got. I got. I'll take. I'll take right. I'll take right. No, Mark's me. Oh, oh, what do we got? What do we got? What? Oh, yep. Mark got it. Yep. Mark's fast. He is. Everyone fast. knows. Everyone's scared of Mark. He's fast. They He's are. Legit you can hear the hear the cries in the crowds every time he comes up. Oh, that's Mark. That's Mark. <laughs> nice. Thank you very much. Thank you. Oh yeah. Are you guys buddies? Huh? Are you guys buddies? No, I just hear his name all the time. Oh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> Wonder Bread. Wonder Bread coming back. Bread. Two seven three. No, that was his reaction. Oh. One nine seven is. Oh, I'm sorry. One. Okay, that's more. Okay. <laughs> I, 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 nothing I can do about that. John just put down a one nine seven. What you got? No two up. No two zero. Turn up. All right. Oh, oh. Turn it up a little bit. Right lane, Matt. Going to the next round. What'd you, what'd you get? What'd you get? 206 again. Okay, okay. You didn't take what I put in it. Biggie Bo, right lane. Moving on. Let's do this. On to the next round. Is this his second, his second, yeah. second entry in this round? Gotcha, gotcha. The boy over here doing one nine seven it's like it's his job, bro. Quietly too, ain't nobody talking about. I know him. everyone gets excited when they're doing like twos, like low twos, and like oh man, he's the fastest. Then we're like, this is like an under two almost every pass. Wonder bread in the right lane. Wonder bread right lane. Left lane, Matt. Moving on to the next round. He got squirrely on that one. He had to let out. He had to do some driving. Just one more entry, right? Yeah, he does. Yeah, he does. And that entry's already moving on to the fifth round or whatever, so we're good. Good day. I had to pedal it. Yeah, you did. There you go. Last lane, Mark Vine. Moving on. Go, Bobby. What are you talking about, What'd you bring? 205. 205. 205. Consistent. 205 and consistent. There you go. All right, they just announced that we are on race 310 for the night. It's a long night. Supra! Supra took it. Oh, no. What? Really? I did not see that. I believe this is the first pair of the fifth or sixth round. We have 20 cars left, so whatever that is. 20 cars left out of 300 and some odd entries. Here we go. Turn it up more, we'll see if it takes it. Okay. Turn it down out the back.
back turned up down low, so to speak. You knew this man. Hey. <laughs> Hey, consistency! Consistency! We got Biggie. I got right. Look at the stance on it. Biggie's got the stance, though. Yo! Biggie, 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 can't you see? Albuquerque. You guys aren't racing each other, are you? Yeah. Are they racing each other? Maddie and Sean. No! Yeah. Oh, we didn't want to see this. Our buddies Matt and Sean from Albuquerque have to race each other. This sucks. Ooh. Ooh. Sean moving on to the next round. Appreciate it, man. Appreciate it. Left lane. Damn, that was the race. The further these these rounds go, the closer the racers the races get. Because nobody's going all over the place. Everybody's going A to B or putting some good power down. It is currently 1:47 in the morning. We are still going at it. There's a few guys still left. I think there's between five and ten racers left, I believe. And we're getting to the nitty gritty of it. This has been a really long day, but I'm really excited to see this thing get done and see how these guys do this stuff. I'm going to go check in with our New Mexico racers. I think either one or both of them are still in. They're still here. You had to take out one of your own, but that's how it happens, I Matt's guess. Matt's been whooping me for the past three or four races straight. Really? <laughs> Back home. Oh, yeah. Home. I get him, and he beats me every time. I'm like, dang it, Matt. Well, that's you all I was like, time. you know, I'm putting a stop to that today. <laughs> no, here's just luck of the draw, you know, right? Yeah, yeah. Luck of the draw. Not come in and bust my ass again. I'll Sorry. beat his ass at home. He will. <laughs> I have been the last three races. <laughs> well, how many racers are, well, we got five racers left? There's six of us left. Six of you left. Yeah. Okay. So you win, you have one more race, you're in the money. One more race in the money. And okay. I, I think three of those six already had buys. I didn't even know you guys did this for at the beginning of the day, and you guys do this, and you guys do it well, apparently. So we made, we made some progress lately. We've been working hard. So that's yeah. good. That's good. So your racing program's kind of a long way. So yeah, it's been working. Well, we'll see in the what is it quarter semifinal quarter final. I don't know what they call it now. I think mean, it'd be quarterfinals. Quarter right? Quarter yeah. Quarter. Yeah. Quarter. Yeah. quarter. Yeah. Quarter. We'll see in the quarterfinals. Three. Yeah, that'd be it, right? Yeah. yeah. Six cars left in this whole deal. Just six. So we got three pairs, and then we got a pair and a buy. Yeah. And then we got a final. We only got three. What, what, what was that? Four, four races, like, five races left? Yeah, not bad. It's not bad. Like Wonder bread. Got on this one. Let's go. Oh, 100 extra? Yeah. We got a side bet on this one? Yeah, 100 bucks. All right. Hey, Sean. We like side bets. You guys made it so far. I didn't even know you did this till today. <laughs> Good job, Frank. Yeah. We'll be back. All right. We'll be back. Until we meet again? Absolutely. We'll see you guys. Later, buddy. You have a good one. Later, boss. That sucks. That, was good. that sucks. It's kind of the guys that we knew here. We know them from real racing or actual. I don't want to say real. It's real racing. Car racing. Regular car racing. We know them from that in Albuquerque. And uh, they apparently do this. So what do we got? Do we have anybody we know left? No? Nope. Biggie, Biggie, Biggie. Here we go. Oh, Biggie versus Mark? Is that what it is? Good luck. Thank you.
He does the smoky burnout. He does the good ones. That's when I've seen the entire He's been doing them all day like that. Really? Yeah, all day he's been doing the good ones. Oh! EQ, take flight. AZ, fire. Oh, no. Left lane. Takes the win. I wouldn't do it like that, man. All right, we have three cars left. They just did the burnout for the for the for the semifinal pair right here. And then we got to buy, and then we got the final. Seventy-five hours. Ooh! Right, right. Mm. Oh, 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 dang! Oh, dang. Going to the finals. Going to the finals. Going to the finals. Nice. See you, see you there. Thanks. All right. This guy gets a bye to the final. Let's see what he does. We got Mark. We got Mark. All right. Here's the final. This is for all the money right here. Oh! Good race. Congrats, man. Finish margin zero zero two. Oh, jeez. Oh. Yeah. Crazy. Good racing today, man. Good racing. Awesome. Thank like you. Camera got it. Congrats, man. Thanks, man. Hell yeah. What are you taking home after that? I don't even know, man. I have no no idea, man. No idea. Look at the fat stacks on those things. Thanks. <laughs> Look at how thick them stacks are. Yeah. That is crazy. All right, now you got to fan it out. You got to show us all. all. <laughs> that's, what, that's what you got to do. Normally we'd have you lay it on like the wing of the car, but it's a little bit bigger than the wing. Yeah. There you go. Look at it all. Look at that. <laughs> yeah, there we go. Yeah. Playing with RC cars. Oh, just gave yeah. Jeez. There's a couple hundreds in there. Look at that. Nice. I think I got the. Oh, no, you got the. <laughs> <laughs> Congrats, guys. Nice. That's freaking awesome. Never in my life did I think I'd see that in an RC race. <laughs> That's awesome. Thank you guys so much for inviting hey, us. Thank you guys. Hell yeah. All right, guys. It is 2.55 in the morning. We just got done with the final. I don't know how much money just got exchanged, but tens of thousands of dollars just went to these guys. Uh, shout out to them. This was an awesome event for us to come to. We've never been to an RC race like this. We've never been to an RC race, period. And to come to one like this with a huge payout, all these racers, was freaking awesome. We even knew some, some of the racers and had no idea they were RC guys. Shout out to everybody that invited us, all the racers, all the guys that were running the race. Everybody was super nice to us, explaining everything to us. We're, we don't know, we didn't know anything about this before this weekend. Now I feel like we've got a little taste of it. I hope this video was pretty informative to you guys that don't know anything about this, just like we, just like we did at the beginning of the day. Go to show you, you don't have to have a $100,000 race car to win $20,000. You could do it with an RC car, which it blows our mind, seriously. But thank you guys so much for watching. Hopefully this was entertaining. RC car stuff is way bigger than we thought it was. And uh, this might not be the last race we do. So hope you guys liked the video, and we'll see you guys in the next one.